Good morning again. In this video, we're going to look at this field extension Q adjoin the cube root of 5 and show why it's not a normal extension. So, uh, recall the idea was that a normal extension, well, there are two ways we could think about it. One is that if you had an extension E over F, this was normal if E is the splitting field. Of some polynomial. Some polynomial uh, in F adjoin X. Okay, so splitting fields are always normal extensions. Normal extensions are always splitting fields. If you want to show that something is not a normal extension, though, uh, well, showing that your extension is not the splitting field, that, that actually sounds rather difficult. So the, our original definition of normality said that E over F is normal. And this we showed was an equivalent definition. If whenever you had some polynomial coefficients in F, um, and whenever that F has a, right, a root, so just we know it has a root in E, then E contains all roots of F. So that means that if we want to show something is not normal, we, near, we um, only need to find a single example of a polynomial that has a root in E, but which does not have all of its roots in E. So in our case, we're looking at where E is equal to Q adjoin the cube root of 5, and our f is equal to q. Now, the tip off here is this cube root of 5. We know that the cube root of 5 is a root of x cubed minus 5, which is a polynomial with coefficients in q. And as we've shown in another video, the roots of this polynomial, well, there's the cube root of 5, but you also have the cube root of 5 alpha and the cube root of 5 alpha squared, where alpha is e to the 2 pi i over 3. Now, as we showed in that other video, if you want to graph where alpha is in the complex plane, so this is your real axis, there's your imaginary axis, you need here that angle in radians to be 2 pi over 3 where this says length 1. So that's where your alpha is. And the point of all this is just that alpha is not a real number. It's not on the real number line. If it's not a real number, then we know that alpha is not going to be in Q adjoin the cube root of 5. And neither is the cube root of 5 times alpha. Right? Because this is still going to be a non-real number. And so in particular, we have just found a polynomial, x cubed minus 5, which has a root, q, uh, cube root of 5, which is in the extension field, E. But it has another root, cube root of 5 alpha, which is not an E. So that's an E. This is not an E. And that means that E is not a normal extension.